Hello and welcome to the Tottenham America channel. Today we will be reacting to Tottenham Hotspur's win in the UCL against Marseille in the 2022-2023 UEFA Champions League group stage at home in the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium to give them their first win in the Champions League since 2019. I believe the last one was probably against Olympiacos. Thanks to two goals, two headed goals from Spurs' new number nine, Richarlison. We're going to start with some important events of the match. A very quiet first half for both sides. No shots on target from Spurs' side, nor from Marseille. It all kicked off in the second half when, in the 47th minute, Chancel Mbemba is shown a straight red card for bringing down Son Hyung min uh, as he was the last man. Um, it was a red card in the name of a go denial of go obvious goal-scoring opportunity. The Marseille defender clips on just as he enters the Marseille penalty area. And the Marseille defender is sent off right after half time. This had an eventual effect on the match as in the 76th minute, Perisic cuts in on the left side and swings in a beautiful cross on his right foot. And Richarlison gets his head on it and plants it into the goal. Literally dead down the middle. Um, a little high up, but dead down the middle. Should have been an easy save for Paulo Lopez. But the speed and the velocity on the header from Richarlison was too much for Marseille's goalkeeper. And Tottenham Hotspur took the lead thanks to Richarlison's first ever Tottenham Hotspur goal. In the 81st minute, it didn't take him that long to get his second Tottenham Hotspur goal over Charleston scores. Spurs take a corner, headed, uh, and it was headed cleared. Then Hoybier recycles the ball and puts in a great cross for Richarlison to head smack dab onto the post, which directs it into the goal. Um, and Richarlison has his second Spurs goal. That's how the match ended with a 2-0 win. Two Spurs and a clean sheet in their first UCL appearance of the season and a great way to kick off the U U UEFA Champions League season 2022-2023. I think man of the match is obvious. Yeah, man of the match is pretty obvious. It goes to Richarlison. Two goals, opening a Spurs account for the first time and in the Champions League on top of that. Just an overall great performance, especially in the second half. Always moving around, ready to do something. And I think it's an easy decision to give Richarlison man of the match. Uh, first 20 minutes, I thought we were losing this because we looked absolutely defeated even in the first 20 minutes. Marseille were throwing everything at us. Um, we couldn't get any anything on the ball. We couldn't attack at all. We didn't get any shots off. Um, Marseille were just really good, especially in the first half. But then in the second half is when the match actually started. Um, we got two quick-fire goals from Richardson. They were both great headers. Um, but yeah. We really, it took a while for us to get into the game. But once we did get into the game, thanks to uh, the red card that Son Young Min won, I think it was quite easy for us to break them down, which was very important. Another thing, um, Kolasinac, when Kolasinac came on, the former Arsenal player for Marseille, um, I think Tavares had to move to the right side, which he's not as comfortable on. He's more comfortable on the left side, and um, Kolasinac took the left side when he came on. And I think that allowed Perisic to get around Tavares easy, since a little, he's a little more weak on the right side, especially for the first goal. Um, so that definitely helped us out a lot. Yeah, definitely. Um, I thought our defense, Longley impressed me a lot, and I was surprised that he was taken off so early, unless it's just the fact that he's being saved for Sunday. Saturday when we play Man City because he was just so he's such a good defender. Yeah, we need to if he keeps performing like this, we need to get a permanent deal on him. Yeah, he's a solid left-footed defender, and it's he's one that we need. He looks like Vertonghen. Yeah, we haven't seen anyone who looks so much like Vertonghen since Vertonghen himself. So it was just a really good performance from Klama Longley on that left side. Romero getting up the pitch very well today. Um, who else? Uh, ben Tanker and Hoybier ran the midfield as usual. They had a pretty big presence. Perisic with a great assist for Richarlison's first goal. Uh, Hoybier with the second assist. 
Emerson Royale didn't do too bad at all today, but he was subbed off quite early um, for Kulusevsky, who made a huge impact. I don't think there impact. were many, like, bad performances. Yeah, definitely. Um, they all helped that in some way, especially in the second half. Um, but yeah, that is it for our instant reaction to Tottenham Hotspur's first win of the season in the UEFA Champions League as they kick off things with a 2-0 draw against Marseille, courtesy of a Richarlison double. If you enjoyed this match, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like the subscribe button, uh, hit the subscribe button, like the video if you enjoy our content, comment down below what your, um, who your man of the match is, and until next time, come on you Spurs!